Hello everybody, TikTok here. Hope all is well. Today I'm just gonna make a short video on how you can go ahead and turn Cortana off since the new anniversary update for Windows 10 is not allowing you to turn it off with the tab anymore. Uh, this is for the home version of Windows 10. If you have Pro or Enterprise Edition, there's a different and a little bit easier way to do it. I'll put the link to my other video how to go ahead and turn that off in the description down below but like I said this is how you want to go ahead and turn Cortana off in uh, Windows 10 home anniversary update so let's go ahead and get started the first thing you want to do is Windows key and R which will open up this little window down here and then you're gonna to want to type in reg edit R E G E D I T. Now, a little disclaimer we are going into the registry, so you want to make sure you follow this step by step. Uh, you don't want to mess around with too much in there because there is a possibility that you can uh, screw your machine up pretty bad. So, make sure you go ahead and follow this step by step. Once you have that typed in, go ahead and click OK, which is going to open up this window, and then we're going to want to come to H key local machine and we're going to want to expand that and then once you have that expanded we're going to want to go down here to software expand software and then we're going to want to look for policies the same again go ahead and expand policies and then expand Microsoft and then go ahead and expand Windows now, once you have Windows expanded, you may or may not have a folder in here named Windows Search. And you can see I don't have one in here. So you're gonna wanna go ahead and uh, make one. Now, granted, if you do have the Windows Search key in here, just keep watching and you'll, you'll see how to go ahead and do it. But if you don't, you want to go up here to the Windows folder and right click on the Windows folder and then down to new and then you want to do key and then once you want to rename that Windows search and then go ahead and hit enter and now that you have that in there, you want to go ahead and right click on Windows Search. Go to New and then DWORD 32 bit value. You're going to want to click on that. And then in that box, we are going to type Allow. Maybe. Remember how to spell allow Cortana. And you want to make sure type it the same way that uh, I'm typing it now. I just want to make sure I spell Cortana, right? And you want to make sure the capitalization, everything is uh, typed in there. And then once you have allow Cortana, go ahead and hit enter. And then now that you have this, go ahead and double click on allow Cortana and make sure your value data is set to zero, which is basically saying it's gonna turn, turn it off. And then go ahead and hit okay. And if you already did have the Windows search and you didn't have to make a new one, all you would do is open up the Windows search and then Go to allow Cortana, double click on that and make sure that value is set to zero. And then go ahead and close that out. Now you'll notice once you close it out, nothing has changed here. That's because you have to uh, go ahead and restart your computer for the changes to take effect. So I'm gonna go ahead and restart and I will be back in a second. And I'm back. And you'll notice down here in the search bar that there is no more microphone. Cortana is now turned off. You can also go over here to the apps and you can also see that uh, Cortana is definitely turned off. 
And that's all that's to it. Uh, if this video helped you out, please give me a like. And thanks for watching. Have a good day.